de trabalhar. Take a look at Picasso's Guernica, for example. The severity of the screams, the, the crying out in anguish. They're trapped in a, a black and white and shades of gray world. The, they're being devoured and, and, and destroyed. Do you see it? No, but you do, and that's cool. Night security, Bob. Randy! Randy! You forgot your... big consignment store whose proprietors fancy themselves a keen eye. This, this is crap, 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 crap. This, this is no crap. This is raw. So he, he was being harassed by German soldiers. Are you random? One of the officers, he, he saw the painting in Picasso's apartment. You can't hang your own art in the gallery. I didn't put that art there. And he asked Picasso, he said, 
Did you do that? You can't get someone else to do it either. Bob was relieved of his post earlier. Bob would, he would never leave his post. And Picasso's response was, no, you did. Please, Bob's a nice guy. He's my friend. But we're going to have to terminate you as well. Terminate? It's vandalism, Mr. Witsey. No, this is vandalism. Hello, this is Henry. What's up there? Go away, Dick. Hey, buddy. It's me. Red, red locks? <laughs> yeah. Open up the door. You may enter. I don't want to enter. Well, I'm not leaving. It smells awful in here. I'm sorry. I threw up. They fired me. I'm really sorry. Hey, 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 hey. Don't be sorry. It's okay. It's okay. It's their loss. But I like it here. Well, in the bathroom? Hey, remember Ma had to leave? Do you? We didn't like that either, but, but there was nothing we can do about it. So what did we do? Hmm? What did we do? We moved on together, and we found our feet. Can we do that again? Find our feet? Yeah, that's right. Find our feet. What are you smirking at? You should see what I'm seeing, man. Yeah, you're a mess. I am a mess. <laughs> I want Muddy to go home now. All right, let's get out of here. You have the pleasure of speaking to Maurizio Doro. And? You must be raw. I'm here to apologize. Look, um, I'm a lot of things. And raw is definitely one of them. But why are you apologizing? May I come in? Uh, sure. This is nice. I've come to offer you a job. A job? As I understand it, I cost you your job at the Yellow Peril when I inquired about your artwork hanging on display. I'm here now to make amends. Oh. What's wrong? Your work is good. You just need guidance, refinement. You need moi. I like your look, though. 
ruggedly handsome for a painter. Hey, Randy. Come here, buddy. This is my brother, Randy. All right? And it's him you owe the apology to. Randy, this is Mr. Mazzarino. Maurizio Doro. Yes, Eric. Maurizio, of course. Yeah. It's because of him you got fired. Have a seat. So, are you wrong? It was an acronym for my name. It's Randall Andrew Witsi. Of course it is. But you also raw in more ways than one. You have talent, but you need to cultivate it. You are but a stone, an uncut diamond. Once we have you cut, you will shine like the gem you are. You will be brilliant. Wait, what? What would you say if I told you that I have a good friend at New England Tech who can help you expand your skills? Gratis. A school for, for art? Precisely. Um, yeah, I, I don't know. Uh, to me, uh, school just teaches you things that I, I probably never use. You're being pessimistic. School is for people like you. There's nothing wrong with me. I, I, I don't need your help, and I don't need your school. No, I just, I, I don't want to do that. <sighs> I'm sorry. If you know what's good for your brother, you'll see that it's at my galleria tomorrow morning, 11 a.m. You'll be ashamed to miss the kind of opportunity that I'm prepared to offer him. Goodbye. Thanks for coming. Coach! Yeah. And the boy you can paint arrives. Hi. Come, Hunter, be amazed. Poch to Cabernet, chop, chop. It's 11 a.m. Yes, of course, make a Chardonnay. And yeah. Doriango, magnifico, vero? A rare palazzo. Of course, not so rare for my galleria. This one. The boy speaks, and it would appear you have quite the eye. Do you like? I don't recognize the artist, and it's uh, 
It's probably for a good reason. It's not very good. It's... Why did you buy that work? I didn't. I painted it. Come, drink with me. Oh, uh, do you have iced coffee with no ice? Molto bene. Andiamo. You'll be responsible for phones, setting up showing, helping clients with whatever they want. Chiaro? You want me to work out there? Yes, as a receptionist. I'd rather clean. Can, it, can I be uh, your custodian? A janitor. You want to be my janitor? A janitor is often a synonym for custodian. I have a service that cleans for me, Randy. I would do a, a better job, and it would cost you less, a, a, a lot less. Mamma mia. One step back, two steps forward, I hope. Are you sure you want to be my janitor? Yes. Yes, I'm sure. Buongiorno. Art Prop Gallery will be closed for renovation. And I won't be needing your service until we reopen. Grazie. Arrivederci. for alcohol is ever increasing. Yeah, aren't we feeling forward today? Which reminds me, we need to change the filters when we get home. I change the filter first of the month every quarter as directed. That's why I love you, brother. Always on top of things. Excuse me, are you, uh, you guys staying for the game? Uh, the game's like the ones on TV? No, like a uh, kickball game out in the parking lot. Oh, I don't like sports. Oh, well, uh, you have a prime position here, and this place is jam-packed. Ain't that too bad. Do you mind if we join you? Mm. Well, not at all, pretty lady. Please, uh, take a seat. Hey, hey, come on. Hi, I'm Sienna. Sienna is an earth pigment containing iron oxide and uh, magnesium oxide. And it's also my name. <laughs> and this is my boyfriend, Clinton. I did not have sexual relations with that woman. Wow, that was really good. Yeah. I think I can do better. God, no, please don't. Well, look, I'm Henry, and uh, this is my little brother, Randy. Say hi, Randy. Hello. Hey, Chip. There we go. That's mine. Thank you. Thanks, buddy. Perfect. All right, man, thank you. Yeah, and the game, too, Chip. Thank you. Yeah, I got you, Mr. Nielsen. Oh, Nielsen. As in Patriot Disposal Nielsen's? <laughs> Nielsen as a trash company, Nielsen? Yeah. What? Dude, I work for you. Well, actually, you work for his grandfather. This is Clinton Nielsen III. Do you want to tell him where we live, too, babe? Accident. These pants are Brooks Brothers. Yo, relax, all right? Oh, what, trash man? My family already owns you. Let's go. Just relax. I'll see you at home. It's Parriba. Parriba. Abajo. Bala, bala, bala. Bala, bala, bala. Bala, bala, bala. Hey! Hey, buddy, come back! Fante! Hey, one shot! Hey, there's one. There's more. Go, go, go! Go!
Bra is, um, it's an acronym for my name. It's, uh, Randall Andrew Woodsy. Did you paint that? Yeah. It's very nice. Thank you. Hey, can you tell Harry that I said thanks? His name is, uh, Henry, but I, I call him Redlocks. <laughs> I get that, Redlocks. Here. Well, tell him I said thanks. And, uh, See you later, Rob. Okay. Goodbye. All right, good night. What an update. You did well today. I will have you back on Wednesday. You don't want me back tomorrow? Tomorrow you meet with Maxwell von Hostdorf. Sounds German. Tragically so. Why do you want me to meet with German Maxwell von Hostdorf? Have a seat. Don't worry. Have a seat. So, he's a renowned art professor. I told him about your work, and he's agreed to meet you. Possibly give you a trial in his class. A scholarship? <laughs> Tuition costs $40,000 a year, sweetheart. Not a scholarship. At least, not yet. But if he likes your work, you'll be auditing his class. Audit? Audit his class? Dear me, boy, you will take his class. But I don't have enough money. You'll be auditing the class. Which means you will take it for free for the time being, but you won't be enrolled. So, you're the boy Maurizio's been raving about. Yeah, I believe you have something for me. Let's take a look. <laughs> huh? Uh huh? Yeah? Oh, have you anything else? Uh huh? Oh, now this one interests me. What is that? that? A cocktail napkin. Yeah, indeed. But what is the work that is on the cocktail napkin? Sweet Sienna. Oh, yeah. Almost a found art quality. A touch of realism, of genuine rare, strong angles, strokes reminiscent of Victorian charcoal. And how did you create these red and yellow hues? Ketchup and mustard. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Very good. I, I, I think you can audit my class, if you wish. The special session has already begun. But I believe I can bring you up to speed. So, right here. Monday morning, 11.30 a.m. Don't be late. Yeah, that, that should be uh, good. Yeah, okay. Uh, All right. Thank you. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Now, the whole point of this game is, see, you got to stick in your hand, right? Okay. See how long it is? It's hard, right? And see these balls? And you want to hit the balls. Hit all the balls there. Hi. Hey, brother, what's going on, man? Uh, can you uh, step out for a second? Oh, Randy, man, is... Uh, can you please step out for a second? Um, I'm gonna go get a drink. All right, hurry. Thank you. Yeah, we need to work on your game, kid. Yeah, I want to see Mom. Ma, what's wrong? Nothing's wrong. I just, I want to tell her the good news, and you need to take me. Can't now, Randy. And I got doubles all month, and, uh, you know. We're not working right now, though, so. Yeah, but you just can't just show up unannounced, kid. All right? What? what? Because Briarcliff has visiting hours. Look at me. If you want to go see her, we'll go soon. 
All right? Promise? Yeah, promise. So what's the good news? I'm going to the school and I, I took the job. Say that again. I took the job and I'm going to be working with Mr. Gold at Art Park Gallery in Providence. And then I'm going to New England Tech to audit the class. That's fantastic, buddy. Come yes. 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 That's awesome. Come here. All right? Now you're taking risks and you're stepping out of your comfort zone. All right? Like I always taught you. That, that, my friend, takes cojones. Cojones? You know, uh, your man cubes, your seat holders, man your uh, your juice boxes. Juice boxes? Yeah, your prizes. You got the cash and you got the prizes. Yeah? Uh, yeah, your, yeah, your prizes. walnuts, well, your peanuts. Yeah, peanuts. Do I have to spell it out here? Your balls, Randy, your balls. Look down. Woo, uh, there we go. Uh, now look at me, don't. OK. Oh, yeah, I get it. Hey, Chip, one shot Patron, one ice coffee. With no ice. With no ice, bud. Uh, yeah, your friend can come back. I'm so proud of you. Come here, man. You know, tomorrow, we're going to have to buy you some supplies. You know, I've been saying I already something. have my art supplies. Um, the professor, Max Van Horstorff, is German. See? Now, losing the job was the best thing that could happen. Mm -hmm. Told you, baby, bro. We always... Yo, know, we always bounce back, right? Oh. It's your day. Yeah. That's it. Mm -hmm. yeah. Hey, look who's here. Sienna and an angry, trust-from baby boyfriend. Now, watch this. <clears throat> what up, Beauty and the Beast? OK, okay. yeah. Get off. Get off me. Yeah. Is that your pop says about his coattails? Oh, you want to talk about this trash bag? Oh, really? Relax, bro, all right? You want to make a fool of yourself on the uh, lady again, remember? You stupid. Let's get out of here. I want to stay. You said it was my night. This is your night. To somewhere else. Okay, well, being a baby. I am not being a baby. Okay, well, I want to stay with my friends. Seriously. I stayed up all night trying to help you, and now you want to leave? Go. I'm going to stay here with Randy and Harry. Henry. 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 <laughs> okay, take this. Yo, yo, ask him to buy a drink. Randy. Can I buy you a drink? Yes, please. <sighs> okay, go, go, go. I want you to meet, uh, um, K Courtney. Hi. Yeah. Chardonnay, please. <laughs> A little city built on seven hills. One man, one vision with some small. I don't think you should be walking anywhere. Yeah, I don't think so either. <laughs> or driving. <laughs> Pretty much anything, yeah. Uh, I'll, I'll walk. Um, I just had iced coffee with no ice, so... Um, if you want. I'd like that. Okay, yeah. Uh, hold on. I got it. Uh, can, uh, it's my sweater, so... It's cold. Are you going to sleep? <laughs> Thank you. Mm. Are you going to be okay? I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm just going to hang out. You guys go ahead and... Toodaloo! Find your way. Okay. You ready? Yeah. Yeah, I'm All right. I'll see you. Bye. I'll see you later. Good. Uh, 
have fun. Yeah. All right. All right. Okay. So, um, Red Loxy became my brother when I was really little, and uh, we kind of just grew up together. So then you're adopted. Um, my my real parents they they abandoned me uh, when I was five in the lobby of Women and Infants Hospital, and then Red Locks and uh, my mom, my real mom, I call her my real mom. They they brought me in and, and raised me ever since that. You're blessed. Hmm. Do you ever wonder about your real parents? No, because they left me and then I barely knew them, so I have. Red Locks, uh, who's, who's my brother, and I have my mom, my, my real mom, and, and I have a roof over my head, a, a house, and that's that's all that really matters. Right. I have my roof, my father. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I my home. Are you um, not happy here? I came from a small town in Mexico when I was younger. My dad got a job here, and ever since we've been here, my parents just tell me to find some rich American boy to marry. I know. It seems backwards. Yeah. <laughs> That's what I thought, too. Is, is Clinton a rich American boy? Yeah. I guess I'm just hoping that he's something more than that. He's, he's, uh, he's not very nice to you, so. say. No, he is. I just want to be with somebody that wants to be with me and doesn't need me. Yeah. So, are you a Patriots fan, Red Sox? <laughs> I don't. I don't like sports. What? Yeah, sports are uh, dangerous. I thought every guy liked sports. Not this guy. Have you been to a game before? Red Locks, he, um, he says I have no game. <laughs> well, you'll have to come to a game with me sometime. Uh, big crowds, they, they make me nervous. <laughs> I'll be there with you. It'll be fine. Yeah. Hey, thanks for, um, taking this walk with me tonight. Uh... Yeah, um, could I, uh, have your number, um, so I can contact you about the, the, the <laughs> um. Well, Henry doesn't know what he's talking about because that's some game you have there. Is that me? Oh, uh, it's, it's a work in progress. Um, um, can I, uh, have my pencil? <laughs> yeah, okay. That's, yeah. Thank you. Mr. George, please take position one. Why? Mr. Vitsi, please take position three next to Ms. Monroe. Go on, please. Hi, my name's Randy. Today, I would like you to paint anything. Anything at all. Like anything? Yeah, anything. Today is about getting what's in your mind onto the canvas. A clean mind on the dirty canvas begins the process of distilling our impurities. Today, you may paint anything you like in whatever style you like, but you may use only one brush. And you may begin 
now. What are you gonna paint? Anything. Ah, the abstract. Lacks the control and clear edges of certainty that can give it its confidence. And here, we have a neo-modern Milleresque that lacks the control and warmth and yet the, the there we are, the deco, yeah, yeah, yeah. What are you yeah. doing? What are you doing? Excuse me? Th this is mine and you, you ruined it. It's not. This is a studio workshop, Mr. Vetsy. If I am to instruct you, if I am to instruct them, I will need to instruct. No. What about, what about his? You, you touched my painting, but his could be way better. Mr. Go Vet over there. Mr. Vitsy, that was rather rude. I'm sorry, it's, it's not your fault, but um, it is. Yeah. Sorry. In this setting, this is our work. It is for everyone to gain experience and for me to share my knowledge. Now, as I was saying, if... Okay. <laughs> this should prove interesting. Yeah, maybe for like the ambition, Have a scuffle with the little lady, get too happy at happy hour, forget to pay child support. Hey, I'm Drew Andrews, Jr., Ed Andrews Bail Bonds. If you're locked up, we'll get you out lickety-split, and we'll get you to court right on time. <coughs> Andrews Bail Bonds, serving the greater New England area since the Nixon administration. Call 401-55-JAIL with two L's. That's 55-J-A-I-L-L. Taliano, Taliano. What's up, Randy? Hello? has grown. I, I paint what I... You know. feel? I know. What do you feel now? I, I feel like I... I don't want to... I don't want to go back to that school. Why is that? I, I think I'm, I'm different than everybody there. And, and the professor, he, he treats me like I'm a child. Pretty damn good artist, baby, bro. But that don't mean that you know everything there is to know about it. If you want to be the best artist you can be, then take advantage of this, of his great chance to learn it in a Christ in, in a structured setting with a with an open door. It's right there for you. I should have been more than I am, Randy. Should have been more than I am. Don't let your ego get in the way. You should consider yourself lucky. You know what I'd give for an opportunity like yours? That's what uh, Redlock says. Who's Redlock? That's what I call my older brother, Redlock. Yeah? Is he a pirate? 
No, he, he's a garbage man. Oh. Well, Red Locks, the garbage man, is very wise. You should listen to him. Artists are replaceable. People are not replaceable. No? Well, tell that to Maurizio. You know how many starry-eyed kids I've seen come through that door? Hell, I was one of them. I've worked for the Italian Eyes for two years. I've never gotten a show. like the model I have chosen? No, I, I, li I like him. Does his form not interest you? I am not a uh, homosexual. That was not the intention of my question. Is there a reason you have chosen to paint this? There's nothing wrong with your, your model. It's very well defined, and I can see why you chose him, but... Uh, his body will, uh, it'll f effectuate uh, realism. So it's a good choice. Uh, it'll be good. Then why does your painting have breasts? It's what he inspired. Mm. Waiter. Mm. What you doing now? Mm, getting ready to go do some errands. Mind if I tag along? We can grab a coffee after. Um, I like it, iced coffee only. So. Sounds good. But with um, with no ice. <laughs> okay, no ice. No ice. This tent that had all these local artists and stuff in there. And I fell in love with the painting of a cactus. And I knew I wanted to be an artist since I was eight. I remember eight well. Right here. Nobody remembers all of eight. I do. But I, I'm not like most people. To new friends. New friends? Yeah. Think so. So the girl that you paint in class, do you know her? Yeah. So she's your girlfriend? No. But you want her to be? Never had one. Do you have her number? Yeah, she gave it to me. That means she's interested. Have you called her? No. Why not? I'm afraid if I call it. She won't pick up. <laughs> you leave a message. 
You should call her. Only if you really want to. Perfect timing. Hey, buddy. Oh, hey, Redlocks. How was your day? Oh, mine was good. Thanks for asking. I think I'm ready to go to the um, sports game with you. Oh, great. Great. What are you doing tomorrow? The Paw Sox are playing at McCoy. Uh, I, have, I have class tomorrow. Oh, uh, what about the next day? I have class then as well. <laughs> well, then that makes it difficult. <laughs> I will. I'll skip class for you. No, don't do that. Don't do that. That's not a good idea. Uh, it's fine. I'm, I'm better than that class anyway. Oh. Well, wow. OK. Uh, I want to bring red locks. Yeah, yeah, that's a, that's a great idea. I'll bring Clinton. Yeah, um, okay, sure, yeah. Okay. That, I'll leave two tickets that we'll call for you. Uh, okay. Okay, I'll see you tomorrow then. We're gonna go uh, to a baseball game with Sienna and her angry boyfriend tomorrow. Oh, we are. She said she will call about two tickets tomorrow. Are you sure that's what she said, Randy? Yes, she said she will call about two tickets tomorrow. <laughs> Pretty sure I know what she meant. Hey, hey, I really don't like a boyfriend. Oh, yeah, uh, I don't, I, yeah, I don't. Yeah. Better boy. I'll see you later, buddy. Don't slam the yeah, door. Yeah, hey. It's gonna be loud. Hey, I got you, all right? Let's go. Uh, Jesus, Randy, come on. You're gonna have a good time, all right? I got you. Let's go. Did you lock the... Yeah, I locked the door. Don't worry about it. Come on. Some people choose to pick you. Some people stay to make you win. I won't give up until you say. I won't give up until you say. Some people doubt the whole thing. Some people try to run me. I know, guy. Oh, yeah. I don't like it. Yeah, it's not for you. Hannah. You're an artist, huh? Art's something I do, yeah. But you draw, like, cartoons and stuff? No, a abstract and picky. Cool. Hey, what do you do? I'm a lawyer. Nearly. Uh, almost. I got like a year left. Redlocks, he doesn't like lawyers. He says that money grubbing ain't holy. <laughs> <laughs> You're a head trip, dude. Yes. Thanks again. This was great. Yeah, thanks for coming. It's nice being around with good people. Yeah. Really like the hot dogs. Yeah. Thanks so much. Yeah. 
It's real big room. Bye, Randy. Bye. What the hell was that? For what? What was what? You just kissed a taken woman. Taken? I don't follow. You can't just kiss someone, Randy. I mean, he's mean to her. Right. Okay. And then I'm nice to her. So. A kiss, you know, it it should be mutual. She kissed me back. Um, I, I mean, I didn't feel like tongue. Did I do it wrong? You crash landed on her face, all right? Come on. Let's get out of here before the American psycho wakes up and finds his ex. Oh. It's a, it's a lot. Yeah. I know, I know I unlocked the car. But you said you locked it. No, I didn't. On the way in. You Shut up. Put your seatbelt on. Okay, let's go, then. God. Uh... Fanny! Uh, hey, Cassie, how are you? Hi, I'm good. Uh, good. We should go, so we're not late. Ah! <laughs> Sorry. Oh. Uh, uh. Mr. Okay. Ritzy. About the girl from your paintings. Ahem. I realize she's a preferred subject, but it's very important that you work on what I present in class. I cannot teach you if you're not following my lessons. I don't like your lessons. <laughs> Fair enough. But this is a very special class that EIT is offering. Something unique. Until constantly defying my syllabus is not just a problem for me, it's also a problem for the other students as well. It's a distraction. Yeah, I don't want to be a distraction. Yeah, I know you don't. But they are distracted. May I go to class now? I, I, I don't... Yeah, where were you yesterday? Is that a, is that a baseball game? Baseball? So you think... Baseball is more important than art? Of course not, but I was with Red Line. I don't care who you were with. If you miss one more class, your time here is done. For stay. Yes, stay, stay. Buenos aires, Randall. Hi, Mr. Gold. Come with me. Have you heard of the artist Maurizio Cavalieri? Painted a tragico, 1879. Molto bene. And only tragico. Do you know why? No. Because he was caught sleeping with his patron's wife. His patron then cut his penis off and slick a knife into his belly and spilled his entrails all over the piazza. The point being is, many men's downfall has been a woman of lust. I don't understand. I hope you never do. Maurizio Doro? Going to war, he said. I'll leave my mother. I'll leave my high bed. The silence, it comes for me. Everything okay? No. What's wrong? Just... Please, uh, be quiet, okay? He left at dawn that day. I don't mean to pry. Sometimes, when life sucks, I go to this beach in Arkansas. It's really beautiful at night. Helps clear my head. I hope things get better for you. Now you know this isn't, this isn't Me too. where I'm supposed to be, he said. Now you know this isn't, this isn't where we're supposed to be. What's your problem? Everyone's against me. What? They all hate her. Who hates who? My sweet Sienna, they hate her. They're, they're jealous of us. Right, you lost me. Never mind, okay? All right, look, whoever sweet Sienna is, however sweet she may be, she seems to be clouding your judgment. How did you know? I heard Maurizio and Ozzo talking, and he said that you're fixated on some subject, all right? 
It's affecting your work. Yeah, we'll be back. You think it's wrong I paint Sweet Sienna in the Germans class? She has a name. And an adjective. Our Pauline. Look, I never met the girl, but it's clear that she has a spell on you. One that you are unable to control. It's all the Germans' fault. I doubt that. But he does not like that you won't paint what he asked. He says that all the time. Well, I suggest you listen. When are you going to give me my own show? Excuse me, Randall, but your insolent tone is off-putting. When are you going to give me my own show? When you show some respect, when your art is up to par and worthy of being displayed at the Art Prof Gallery, my Galleria, when you appreciate the opportunities presented to you, I think you should go back to work now. We discuss the show when I'm ready. Go! Autism? I think so. High functioning, it all makes sense. He has amazing talent, but he seems to be unaware of his condition. If you cut him off, you'll never be able to realize what he can do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I will allow him to continue, provided he stops painting that girl. You think girls like You think that I'm retarded? That I'm not capable of painting anything other than a single subject? Of course not. But you're bursting into my office like this does not help your case. I am not mentally retarded. Randy, one day I will be a brilliant artist and you will respect me. If I want to paint Sienna every day of the week, I will, whether you hate her or not. Randy. No! No! Randy? Couldn't find my bike. What happened? Well, apparently you got a good old-fashioned ass kicking. Did I fight back at least? That's not important. It is. It's very important. What matters is that you're okay now. Thank you, Mr. Gold. You are an outstanding artist, Brandy. You have amazing pro talent, pun intended. But you're lacking a critical understanding of the art form. You're also lacking control of your emotions. What makes great art is this in tandem with this. Heart and head in harmony. Your emotions and your mind, they don't work together like most people. I, I must ask, do you have autism? When I was, when I was three years old, I was diagnosed with Asperger's syndrome. But in 2013, uh, DSM-5, the Diagnostic and Statistical Manual of Mental Disorders, Edition 5 has defined it and other forms of autism inclusively as it's just one thing, it's autism spectrum disorder. It's, it's all one thing, it's not, yeah. Just one, yeah. It's not. That's okay, that's okay. Yeah. I'm sorry, sweetheart. Don't be sorry. Autism, it's, it's what I have. It's not who I am. I'm just, I'm just Randy. Randy. I will give you a hug right now. 
And I'm supposed they will make you uncomfortable. You can do it for two seconds. Cool. Oh, two seconds, okay. Oh, three, but only three. Three it is. And then told me what happened. I'm sorry that he hurt you. How is he? He's all right, I guess. He's he's hurt on the inside too. I feel bad for him. So sweet. No, you're sweet, Sienna. I really think so. Thank you, Ren. Um, do you want to see something uh, in my studio? Sure, yeah. Are these me? Yes, uh, you inspire my feelings. How do I do that? Um, I don't know, you just, you just kind of do. Uh, you're a really strong person and um, I want to be as strong as you. Um, can you, uh, sit on that stool so I can paint? Sit? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, just the stool. Okay. Cool. What do you want me to do? Um, look natural. <laughs> what? Well, it's not really natural for me to just randomly pose for you. Um, okay. All right, um... Listen to this. I got uh, music and just, that's what I do. It's... What song should I listen to? Sure, I'll get there. Yeah. Um, okay, yeah. Yeah, it's a good one. Just put them, yeah, just put them in the ears. And... Lost in the mazes, my heart locked in cages, unlock the cages. Cause I'm like a road, like a road that needs paving, just like a stone, like a stone needing shaping. Don't care if it breaks my bones. Could you be home? Could you be safety, a place to rest my soul? Cause I've been on my own for too long, don't leave it alone. Keep pushing on, baby, cause I've been losing hope. I've been losing, I've been bruised so. Could you be home? Go where? I have to go. Sienna. Uh, yeah. Oh. Okay. I don't want another dog. Dogs die. This ain't just a dog. It's a, um... Hey, look at that. It's a computer. Right? I have other things in my mind, okay? Hey, yeah, I think it means somebody. Don't say it like that. Don't say it like what? Like you're mad at her. You're just upset because you had sex with her and she rejected you. Did you wear a condom? Look, she didn't reject me. We didn't have sex, right? What about you? When are you going to go see mom? Don't change the subject, all right? She's dying. And you just pretend like she's on some kind of big vacation. Hey, hey, this ain't about me, all right? No, it's about me. It's always been about me. Why am I the only one that's supposed to change? You, you say you want more out of life, and then as soon as you get a free moment, you're out drinking it away in a bar. Hey, 
That is enough. It's not enough. It's never enough. I'm, I'm sick and tired of being told what's good for me. I know what's good for me. Hey, look at me. You're about to make a fool of yourself right now. Come I know me. me. I know me. What's his name? Colin. But you know something? If you want this dog, you can call him whatever you want. No, his name's Harlan. Relax. Meet Harlan. Hey, beautiful. Come here. You think you can give this dog a loving home? Yeah. Yeah? Can we keep him? Nobody, get up. Come on, we're gonna be late. Hurry up. Are you feeling stressed, Randy? Very stressed. I don't know how she feels about me. I see. So, this is not. Good. Sw swelling in, in your face, hands, mouth, or throat, chest, tightness, trouble breathing, fast, slow, pounding, or uneven heartbeat, fever, sweating, confusion, or muscle stiffness, I increased hunger or thirst, change in how often you urinate, lightheadedness, dizziness, or fainting, numbness, or, or weakness on one side of your body, sudden or severe headache problems with vision, speech, or walking, painful or, or prolonged erections, uh, seizures or, or, or tremors, breast soreness and nipple discharge in both women and men. Uh, in trouble swallowing, too. Uh, yeah, I, I can't take this. sure to raise your spirit. <laughs> I'm hosting a showcase of several artists and photographers, and I'd like to offer you a spot. One piece, your best work. Really? You, you want to show my work? One piece. Make it great, make it raw. Salute. You can drink. Yeah, cool. I'm excited. It's gonna be cool. So, are you gonna create a new piece or use an existing one? Uh, Mr. Goldie wants me to make a, a new one specifically for this show, so I think I'm just gonna like, cool. do it. <laughs> What's yeah. the concept? I don't know. Um, I don't know yet. Really? Yeah. Isn't the show kind of soon? Yeah, uh, you should probably get working on it. Yeah. I'm gonna do it. You're stronger than me. You always have been. When you really let somebody in, that's when you'll be happy. It's not that easy. Do you 
Just give me a chance, please. What is it, Randy? Is everything okay at home? What does that have to do with the painting? More than you might know. I feel, um, broken or lux. Broken how? No, man. I feel like the, uh, medication is, like, is taking my, uh, my feelings away, and I'm not, I'm not inspired, and I, uh, have nothing to paint. Well, look, buddy, it's, it's only meant to be temporary. I think I, uh, I think I want to stop taking the medication. The pharmacist says you can't just, you know, stop. I want, I want to stop as soon as possible. Oh, God. Let's just give it a little time, all right? Let your body adjust. Do you, uh, do you think Sienna likes me? <sighs> Look, buddy. She definitely likes you, all right? But, um, maybe not in the same way uh, that you like her. What do you mean? Hey, we promise to always be honest with each other, right? Yes. Right? I'm always honest. Yeah, to her fault. All right, buddy, look. She's out of your league. It's... No, hold on. Some women can be very, very uh, superficial, right? Now, they base attraction off a lot of unrealistic qualities and, uh, and attributes in guys. But you can care about somebody, you know, without it being physical. Kind of like loving someone from afar. Just like, uh, just like you love mom um, from afar. Was that an insult, Randy? I am insulted. Yes? And yes, it's an insult. No, Randy, I have. Uh, I really sacrificed. I put any kind of dream I had on that on hold for you. Not quite what I had in mind. Is there anything else you've done? No, that, that, that's my submission. Are you absolutely sure? That's it. That, that's, that's the one I want, OK? Just do that, please. You're not so sweet, Sienna, miss. Prepare this. I think you have more potential than you realize. Consider submitting something else, yes? I don't want to consider anything. I want you to put her up on that wall now. Okay? parking lot after the game, I could tell how much it meant to you. And I want you to know that it felt good for me, too. Well, that's, that's good, right? Yeah, it is. Good. Look, it's not easy for me. I know, um, feelings, it can be, feelings can be hard. Um, but I, there's been something I've been wanting to tell you. Um, no. 
No, please don't. Oh, no. I have to go, Randy. Oh, oh don't. This it is a Look, Randy. Randy. I don't want to hurt you. You're one of the sweetest, most honest, and the most real person I've ever met. Thank you. Look, I'm going through something right now. I don't even know what it is yet. I need to clear my head and figure some things out. And when I do, look at me. I want us to be friends, Andy. There's nothing that I want more than love. Do you understand what I mean by friends? Yeah, yeah. Friends, I... Because... Um, a school friend. I know. Yeah. I'm sorry. Yeah. You still make this harder than it already is. I have to go. But, but, but I love you. Sienna, I love you. Supposed to say it back. You're supposed to say it back. Sienna! You're supposed to say it back. Painting is supposed to be hanging right there, and it's not now. And I want to know why. Well, Mauricio didn't feel like it was your best work. Who's, who's he to judge? This is gallery. I think he's a liar. He said my painting was going to be right there, and then he took it away. Well, he didn't take it away. He was just putting up one of mine instead. He's going to hang one of your paintings. Oh, God, no. No, that would be a train wreck. <laughs> He's putting up one of my photos. Why? 
Why, why are you telling me this? I'm just being honest with you, man. I mean, look, it's not like you don't have uh, skills. I guess you do. It's just that this wasn't your best work. Maurizio only wants to hang the best in his exhibits. This is why he's putting up one of my pieces. I think you're a liar, too. I think you wanted your piece in the show so bad that you told him that my art wasn't any good. You'll never be the artist that I am. I freaking hate you, Butch. We done? Sienna, she, uh, she didn't say it back. Mr. Golden Butcher liars. Everybody hates me. Sure you don't want a nice coffee, no ice? Um, how much for the oh, bottle? doing here? I told you, this is my spot. I time to clear my head. Oh, uh, yeah, I, I remember. I, I didn't realize I walked this far. Where are you going to? I don't know. What? I don't know. Is everything OK? Just having a really bad day. What? Just having a really bad day. something good can come from something bad. You mean like a blessing in disguise? I don't do well with most metaphors. You all have to let go of expectations in order to see things as they are. I've never felt this way before. It hurts on the inside. For art school, I had this really stupid, lousy job. I had money. I was miserable. I'm broke now, but I'm happier doing something that's important to me. What does that have to do with love? Everything. I had to let go of something that wasn't making me feel good anymore so I could allow an opportunity for something better to blossom. Yes, something good and something bad. What if I'm not able to let it go? What inspires you? Feelings, emotions. I just paint 
so I can express what's hard to say. You want to know what I'm feeling? Yes. I'm thinking how lucky anyone would be to know you. Whether you realize it or not, you have showed me that it's okay to be myself. Unapologetically. I think you're great. And I think you are exactly where you need to be. <clears throat> <laughs> that hurt my feet. I lost my way in the crosswinds of a fire. Flames of the air were burning in desire. When the smoke clears and I've paid the cost, will the sound I feel in every bridge crossing a hundred years? I love won't exhaust when I'm with you. I'm not lost when I'm with you. I'm not lost. Um, I, um, I know it's late, but do you want to, um, maybe come in for some coffee? Yeah. What's this? What? Oh, oh. Um, I don't know yet, but I will show it to you if you want. Yeah, okay. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna take this off. This is art. This is emotion. Andy, cacti. <laughs> cacti? Yeah, life changing. For some people, this is completely life changing. Yeah, hey, uh, I did that before school. You did this before school? Before I, I went to school. Wow. You think you can still get us that in the Galleria? Well, um, I'm not sure yet, but uh, if I were to, it would have to be something raw. Oh, uh -huh. you better get to work. <laughs> <clears throat> For the inspiration. Mm. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, thanks for the coffee. Oh, you're welcome. Good luck. <clears throat> okay. We're just getting older, so you say. All my clever words can make you stay.
The prodigal son has returned. How can I help you? I've been painting. Obviously. I painted my truth. It's called a, an apology. I see. But Well done, sir. Well done, indeed. Thank you. Go home. Get a haircut. Put on something respectable. Go. You're going to show my piece? This is a piece worth showing. What about Butch? I may be the Italian ice. But this, 24 karat. Oh, so, so we're both going to get the show then? Yes. You, go, hurry up, before I change my mind. Thank you, Mr. Gold. Thank you. You came. I wanted to show my support, you know? Even if it's just in spirit. You're not thinking about going in, are you? <laughs> nah, I think that guy's seen enough of me for a lifetime. You look beautiful. Do you want to go for a walk? Mr. Vitzi, this is your night. Enjoy yourself. I am very proud of you, Randy. Thank you. <laughs> it's grape juice, in case the snobs think you're weird. But I am weird. Aren't we all? <laughs> I have some wine. Waiter! I'm very proud of you. Salute. Proceed. I'll be right back. You made it. I would have missed it. You look really nice, Cassie. Thank you. You look nice, too. <laughs> it's a really great turnout. It's not, it's not all for me. Oh. oh, you're the only reason that I came. Um, do you want to show me around? Yeah. Come on. Okay. <laughs> Lest they forget from whence they came. Genauzo. <laughs> hey, baby brother. Redlocks, you made it. Come here. <laughs> <laughs> I really miss you, Mom. Mom, Henry, Cassie, I want to show you my painting. It's called An Apology. A metaphor? Yes, a metaphor. Did, did you paint that? 
Yeah, Mom, I did. My son, Randall is a painter. I surely hope he gets as good as you are one day. Everything has changed since I met you My heart was broken, hope was overdue Running empty, running out of time I thought I lost my mind But everything has changed since I met you Nothing is the same since I met you The hardest times are easy to get through Shadows of the past disturb my night You make them run and hide Cause nothing is the same since I met you Here and now, just hear me out Through fear and doubt I'll never let you down I'll never let you Everything has changed since I kissed you I never thought love could be this true And when I thought that feeling couldn't last You went and kissed me back Cause everything has changed since I kissed you Here I know 